What up ninjas? In the last couple of videos, I was exploring the Sharer's Pond. We thought they got rid of the pond monster, but I think it sucked me down into the water. I'm not sure what did, but all I remember is I woke up here in this really strange hospital. I have no idea if this is a real hospital or what. I don't see any doctors. There's nobody here. I'm all alone. They left me my clothes, although they took all my ninja weapons. I don't have my phone on me. V's probably looking for me. I can't get a hold of her. I finally got this doorway open, so I gotta get out of here and, and find V. All right, here's the door I finally got open. Open. All right. Hello, are there any doctors in here? Nurses? V? This is really creepy, guys. There's nobody in this entire hospital. What is this? This almost looks like a big video game, like an arcade machine. It's got a rollerball here. It says Galaxy on it. Huh. Whoa. Warning. Exclamation mark. Oh. Is this device for hacking computers? Oh, guys, look at this button right here. It's that cassette tape symbol, and it says record. Is this how the hacker watches us? He presses this button and records us on his video? Hmm, but it seems to be off right now. I guess we'll, we'll keep looking here. Oh, here's the door. Oh, exit. Oh, sweet. So he does that. Oh, it's locked. Damn. Okay, all right. I guess I'll keep looking. Whoa. All these bottles. What are these? Check it out. Working solution. It says the matrix. That's another term that hackers like to use, the matrix. They all seem empty though. Wait, wait a second. Wait, do you hear that? Oh, come here. I hear a really weird sound coming through here. Sounds like water running. It was like Whoa. I don't know. Anyway, check it out. There's a piece of paper in this jar. What is this? Well, low V E two eight low O two five nine high O two five five. Huh? I don't know. These don't mean anything to me. Hmm. Guys, if you've seen these numbers or if you've seen like these wordings before, leave a comment down below if you recognize these. It seems faintly familiar, but not exactly. Maybe there's something we have to do with this. I'm gonna put this in my pocket. I feel like we might need this for later. Oh, here's another doorway. Hmm. It says, do not disturb. Well, I'm gonna disturb them anyway. Okay, I'm not gonna disturb them because it's locked. I think I remember reading something from the last video that said something about do not disturb. Guys, leave a comment down below if you remember from the last video, something about do not disturb. I think that might relate to this sign right here. Oh, whoa. I'm not touching that. Look at this, guys. What is that? Red dripping. I think I know what that is. I don't want to say pretty creepy. Why would that be here in a hospital? Usually a hospital is like the cleanest place ever, and that's not very clean. We got to figure out how to break through this door. This might be the way out, or this one. Well, this one says exit, but I don't totally believe that this is the exit. I feel like it might be a trick because it's not taped on there very solidly. See that? It's like this was this was put here to fool me. Um, oh, look at this. Switch off mobile phones in this area. Now, why would they want you to switch off your phone here? Is it because it interferes with hacking of other people's computers? Does it mess things up? <gasps> oh shoot, look at this, look at this. There's a security camera that's been watching us the whole time. Hello, are you, are you watching me? Are you the hacker? What did you do with V? Where, where's V at? Who's in there? <sighs> Man, guys, I'm, I'm really freaked out. I think someone's watching me right now. I don't know for sure, but that camera's up there. I've tried both of these doors. Both of them are locked. There's only one more door left that could possibly lead out of here. It's through this way right here, back into this hospital room. There's another door right over here. Oh, wait a second. Here's that sign I forgot about. It says, to open this door, purge the words, do not disturb. So there's that saying, do not disturb again. So purge means to like erase or get rid of. So I need to get rid of the words, do not disturb. So does that have something to do with that sign out there? I need to get rid of that sign to open this door? Hmm, let's go take a look at that again, guys. Okay, so here's the sign, do not disturb. It says to open that other door. I need to get rid of these words. Oh, wait a second. This is like a lever here. That slides. Whoa, did you guys hear that? I just heard like a click or something over there. Now it says, welcome, please knock. Okay, um, I think that might be it. I think, cause I heard, I heard a click over here. I think it should be. 
Huh. Hmm. Okay. Um, I definitely heard a click. We got rid of the words, do not disturb. Oh, but then it said, please knock. Oh, wait a second. What if I just knock? Did you guys hear that? Whoa. It opened. All right, guys, let's go through here. Final folders, nothing, just empty. A clock. So there's still water in this here. So someone's been here fairly recently. The water hasn't dried up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at this, look at this whiteboard, guys. It says V Quaint TMX. Gosh, what does TMX mean? And it's got a check mark. Kind of like they completed it or something. Steven, is that, what, Carter? Lizzie, wait, these are the shares. What, what, mi what is this word here? M-I-S-S-I-S-S-I-P-P-I-E-N-S-I-S. -S 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 -S. So it says Mississippi, Mississippi and Sis. What does, what does that word mean? It's written next to Stephen, Carter, and Lizzie's names, and they all have check marks. Gosh, what could that mean? Guys, if you know what this word is, leave a comment down below. There's something going on with the shares in this word. They don't live near the Mississippi River because they live on the East Coast. The Mississippi River starts in Minnesota, I think it was all the way down through the middle of the country. So I, I don't know if you guys know what that is. Help me out, leave a comment below. Oh, here's my name, Chad Wild Clay. It says hack. Oh, they have been hacking my YouTube channel. I've had quite a few of my videos deleted. Is that what's going on here? This this is what the hackers are doing? They're doing something with this word with to the shares. They're doing something with TMX to V. Okay, guys, I think these are all clues. We'll have to like take a screenshot of this in our memories and try to remember these. I'm pretty sure these are gonna come in handy for figuring out who this hacker is and what they're doing to all these YouTubers. Let's keep looking around here. Oh, I somehow skipped over this last time. Here's a calendar, but it says June. That's, it's not June right now. Uh, so this is an older calendar. Um, on the 20th, it says find treasure. Oh, interesting. Because V and I found treasure. I think that was on June 20th, if I remember correctly. And then look here. It says on the 27th, it says steel TMX. Ah, what could TMX mean? Oh, because it says steel TMX on the 27th. Then over here, it says V quaint. TMX. Ah, okay guys, I need your help ninjas. Comment down below if you think you know what TMX means, why it's on the 27th of June, how does it relate to V-Quaint. I think that's gonna help us figure out what's going on here. Okay, here we have another computer screen right here and then a chair. So someone's been working at this computer workstation and then over here, there's another computer screen right here with another chair. Is there like a team of hackers like sitting here hacking YouTubers? Oh, oh, there's a keyboard right here. I wonder if I can hack into this. Hmm. I can't even get the screen to turn on. Maybe they've turned all the power off because they don't want me hacking into their computer. So we gotta keep an eye out for a power switch. Maybe there's a circuit breaker somewhere. I can turn these on and I can hack into their computer. So I'm gonna keep an eye out for that. Oh guys, check this out right here. There's a note. To open, you must have patience and just wait. Okay, so there's a drawer right here. And then there's a lock right here four digits on it. Okay, so we gotta figure out what these digits are. And this note here must be a clue. So it's telling me I just gotta like have patience and wait around. Why would I wait here? How would that help me figure out what the numbers are if I just wait here? Wait a second, the word patience is spelled differently. This is spelled like hospital patients. Yeah, it's not the word patients like like not being in a rush or like being able to wait around. That's like hospital patients. And then wait, like if you wait for something, like you wait 10 minutes, you wait an hour, that's spelled W-A-I-T. This is spelled like how much do you weigh? Like how heavy are you? So it's like hospital patient and then wait. If I'm If I'm the patient in this hospital, maybe the combination is my weight. All right, so we gotta find a scale around here where I can weigh myself. All right. Yeah, I see a scale, guys. It's right down this way, right here. When whoever brought me to this hospital, they must have weighed me and made my weight the combination. That's what I'm hoping, because I said weight. We'll find out. So I'm gonna step on the scale. All right, so how one of these scales works is you start with this heavy weight right here. Try 50 pounds. If I was less than 50 pounds, this lever right here would go down like this. But since it didn't go down, that means I weigh more than 50 pounds. I weigh more than 100 pounds. I weigh more than 150 pounds. 
up, but I weigh less than 200 pounds. All right, I'm gonna bring it back to 150. And now I can use this finer increment of weight. And what I need to do is get this to balance right in the middle, and that'll be my weight. All right, it's balancing right in the middle. I gotta take 150 plus 26. That's all I weigh. So 150 plus 26 is 176. Let's try that in the combination. All right. Oh, but it's got four total digits. So, and I'm 176. So maybe the first digit will be zero. So zero, one, seven, six. We'll try that. Zero, one, seven, Six. Ah, that worked. I'm so glad we figured this out. That was awesome. All right, let's see what is in here. Nothing? Let's keep looking. Oh, what is this? Piece of paper, a pen. All right, what do we got here? It says sign in sheet. So people are signing in to the hospital. Time and then their first name, Bond. Richard, Cosmo, can't read that one, Hayes, Dax, Ginger, oh, is that Ginger from Carl and Ginger? I think her name starts with a J though, so maybe that's not her. Job, whose first name is Job? Darby, Zorgo, I recognize that name. Zorgo, where did we see that name before? If you guys remember where we saw the name Zorgo, leave a comment down below. I know we've seen that name before. Why was that person checking into this hospital? Hmm. Lux, Kipling, Mans, Justin. Wait, is this is this my friend Justin? Was he brought to this hospital? He didn't say anything about going to a hospital. Hmm. Maybe it could be a different Justin. There are a lot of Justins, but I don't see my name on here. I guess that's probably because I didn't come here willingly. I I was like brought here against my will. Does that mean everybody here? whose names I wanted to come here, and so they signed in themselves. If I had my phone, I would take a screenshot of this and remember all these names, just in case we run into these people in the future. But I'm gonna leave these here for now. We gotta still try to find our way out of this hospital, so let's, let's keep looking. All right, the last two doors we have not gone through is this exit door here. Whoa, listen to this, guys. What is going on in there? I hear like low, like Are they like growing pond monsters in here? I'm, I'm kind of worried to go through this door, but it is the exit door, unless it's a trick. Like I said, maybe they want us to go through this door and then like there's a pond monster or something in there. I have no idea. Maybe, let's go back in this room. Maybe there's something in here that we missed before. Maybe there's a clue we missed. Ah, oh, here's some more of those jars that we found earlier. Remember we found that note in the jar? But these are all empty. Um, Wait, 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 wait a second. I see a symbol here, V-E. I remember that. I remember seeing that on this sheet here that we found. Low V-E. Wait a second. Yeah, the V-E and V-E. Check this out, guys. Alarm sets. Oh, so is this how, maybe this is how we can disable all the alarms and all the locks and get out of here. And this is the code, maybe. Let's, let's give it a try. So first it says low V-E, two, eight. Let's go to two. Eight, and then it says low O2, 59, five, nine. And then the final one, high O2, 55, five, five. Oh, you hear that? Oh, what was that, what was that noise? The door totally opened all by itself, guys. I'm kind of worried. Oh, it's closing, it's closing. I just caught it before it closed. All right, guys, let's sneak through here. Let's see what's in here. What? Guys, this is like a classroom here. What the heck, this is really strange. Why would a door from a hospital lead to a classroom? Whoa! Guys, it's my phone. I was looking for this. Why, why is it hooked up? My phone is hooked up to this laptop computer right here. Who took my phone and hooked up to this laptop? I'm gonna check my phone to see if anyone was messing with my phone here. There's a bunch of text messages here to V from my phone. I, I did not send these text messages. Somebody was trying to pretend to be me. They were using my phone to text message V. 
because I did not send these text messages. Guys, I, I, I need your help. I, I need you to go over to V's video and leave her a comment. Let her know that all these text messages that she's been getting from my phone, they were not me. You guys need to let her know that. Shout out to all of you notification ninjas. Thank you for getting here during the first 60 minutes because you have that bell symbol ringing. Guys, V's video is right there. That's where I need you to go leave a comment. Let her know that these text messages were not from me. If you're not subscribed, click here. Subscribe to V there as well. If you want some CWC merch, right up there. All right, guys, I'll see you over on V's video right now. All right, kick bump out.